know what's weird? I've been listening to a lot of Elvis lately, and I don't know why. And it's just odd. I asked all of you guys about your culture, and then I kind of didn't tell you about mine. I mean, I told you, like, my Asian culture, but then I didn't tell you about my, like, normal life scenarios. But I'm, I'm sure you guys kind of know a little bit about it anyway. Like, my friends are insane, and things like that. We, there's a couple of slang terms that we use, and, and it's not just, like, us. It, it's, right, it's not, like, our California. It's just our area, and it's not even our area. It's just, like, a couple, a bunch of people in my school who use this word. And not even everyone uses a word. Okay, this is what happened. I, my friend, she was new here last year at my school, and then she moved into my school, and then... She, we became friends with her and she started using all these words and then we all kind of caught on and then that's just, I don't know where she picked it up from but this is so my group of friends use this word all the time and then I'm sure other people outside of our group of friends uses it and she uses the word bestie a lot like for example Nora and Marissa would be besties. The word I actually really like, and that's in my area, like taken from my area, not like my group of friends, is the word legit. It, I don't know why, it's just, it's it's not even used like correctly sometimes. Because you know legit means like legitimate, like true, and you know, things like that. But mo sometimes you use it as like a substitute for that was cool, almost, so it's like that was legit. And that mean that usually means like that was really cool, or that was that was awesome, blah blah blah. And then, yeah, I don't, I don't know why. I don't know where I, I just started saying that. I don't, I don't, I don't know. Another word that is used around this area that I don't like using is that was boss, or that is so boss. I heard someone use it today. And that's just the same thing as that was legit, or that was cool. And we've also has, uh, my friends use beastie. That was hella beastie. That's always used a lot, too. Oh, that's right. The word hella is just like, you, instead of hell of, we just say hella. Because that's just our thing. So I went online, and then I was looking up some things, and I found the demographic map for soda. Like, which area say what. And it's kind of really funny. And I really like it. Um, I don't have it, like, on a piece of paper, but I am going to link it over here. I found it on Wikipedia, which is really cool. And I just thought it was, I thought it was kind of interesting. Like, you guys should really check this, yeah, you guys should really check this out. Personally, I say soda. What do you guys say? I mean, I'll make that my question. Two, three. Nora! Anyway, my dad's yelling at me to eat because I haven't eaten all day. And I don't know what to eat. You know what? Why don't you guys leave me food suggestions? That'd be a great idea. If you guys could comment with your food suggestions, like foods that you think I should eat, because and everybody always complains about how I never eat or how picky of an eater I, uh, I am. So every time they go, what do you want to eat? I always go, I don't know. And they're always like, that's annoying. Don't do that. Why don't you guys, if you want to, you know, please leave food suggestions for me as well. Because that way I can be all like, I can try that. And I can tell my dad to pick some of that up or whatever. I think I'll see you guys next week because I have been rambling for seven minutes and I don't even know how, what I'm going to cut out or put in and blah, 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 I'm still talking. Okay, Liz, I'll see you on Monday.